Hey everybody, you're waiting to see the magic begin. Mary, thanks so much for being here. Uh, Dion here with the Turquoise Iris, and we're on day three of this beautiful wardrobe makeover. It's beach inspired, and tonight we're actually gonna be working on color washing. We did a little bit of it last night. We finished with the gorgeous new copper that DIY just released on Saturday. It's called Pennies from Heaven. So for those of you that were with us last night, um, we did, Matt and I went back and listened to several versions of Pennies from Heaven. Um, I think my favorite was... My favorite was... Um, favorite who was the, the woman singing? I have no idea. That was sent to us. I think Robert Gloria sent it to me. Um, and then which was your favorite version of Pennies from Heaven? The Elf. The Elf one. So we remembered you guys last night. Beauty Luscious, how you doing, girl? Um, we remembered last night um, when we were listening to the elf of Pennies from Heaven when, he, when, when Elf got to New York and was happy to be there and he's looking around and he's all in his costume and he, not costume, was elf costume, I guess that's what it is, but he kind of stuck out like a sore thumb. Um, so thanks for all of your help with that. Um, copper. Other new product was the um, the Verdigree Wax from DIY, as well as a stain blocker. You guys have to get the stain blocker. Um, for those of you that missed the last two nights, we started with a color combination of mermaid tail and beadboard, and we applied those at the same time, and then we did a color wash of blue iris, which is in my old bottle here, and tonight we're gonna start with Adding in the sunset, or just just kind of a beautiful sky. I'm really excited to work on it, guys, because I also have the bigger one out in the garage, so we get to do that one next. Everybody, hope you're having a good day and a good Monday and making the best of every day. Um, right, Matt? Yes. That's all? Yes. Stacy Hartman says hello, first time live. Hi, Stacey Hartman. I'm so thrilled that you're here. Um, did you hear the Billie Holiday version? Loving where you are on this piece. Bonnie, I don't think I heard the Billie. I did. That was the first one I was That was the first one? Okay, then I did. Then I did, because as soon as we got off of here, he started Googling a bunch of them. Uh, Googling. Yeah, that's the word, Googling. Yeah, I Googled it. Yeah, he Googled it up, like he says. Um, hello, Dee and Matt. Lisa Dixon, how are you? So then we rolled on the new copper patina. From anybody interested, I now have those uploaded to my website. So you can buy directly off the turquoiseiris.com. But look, it's so delicious. Um, speaking of delicious, those brownies, did you take them out of the oven? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Um, we rolled it on. And what we're trying to do is kind of get a backdrop for what it will hopefully be a gorgeous beach inspired piece. And so we're gonna start from the bottom tonight and start working on um, another background, kind of thinking about grass and the things that you see at the beach with this being kind of the water and the sky. I also, yesterday, you can see right here in this area, it's got kind of a yellow tint to it because that was what I was using kind of as the sunlight. And so we sprayed a little bit yellow and I came in here two more times today and I sprayed my yellow on the watered down yellow. So we've done a wash of the blue and then we did a little bit of yellow last night and I did it a couple more times today just so I could get the little warm greeny yellow tint right here. So today I have mixed up cherry, hi mama, I've mixed up cherry picked in my water bottle as well as kissing booth. So I'm gonna start up here and then we'll move the camera down to the bottom and we'll start hand painting while this is drying, okay? So that's the plan, let's go. Okay, so when I say watered down, I mean, okay, Matt, you know what? The um, I don't think YouTube's going to be able to see what I'm doing. It's just not I need to go up a little? high enough. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yep, it's all the way up there because they need to see the top of it. Okay, so <laughs> it makes it look like it's extremely tall. It's not really that tall, but um, I have about 10 to 1 ratio in my water girl and I actually did put the paint in this because I thought well let's go for it and let's see how this goes it's kind of like spray painting 
kind of makes me giggly. All right, let's see if this works. Watch it not work. Uh oh, it's not working. Uh oh. Hang on. Here we go. Okay. Okay, so this is the kissing booth. And I'm spraying it around the edges where I had the blue iris, okay? Matt? Yes. Are you here? Are you reading? Or? I'm here. You're quiet. Oh, I'm just letting you, letting you visit with your peeps. Okay. What's happening? Ah, it looks so good. Alrighty. I love adding in the kissing booth. So now I'm just going to get clear water. This is just water. I'm going to thin that out even more. So of course this is my interpretation, you all, of what a sky would kind of be with the glistening bronze twinkling in the sky and then um, we'll work on getting the beach. So I'm just going to thin this out down here as it goes down so the drips don't show up. Does that make sense? I think so. I'm thinning it out and so it just, the, the longer it drips, the thinner it is and so you can barely see the pink at all because I didn't really want the drips past this area here. All right, and then I'm gonna come back in with another layer of the, of the blue because I'm going to, I'm trying to get a little bit of purple going since that, that bottle with the cherry pick didn't work. A little bit of blue. Whoopsies. Matthew, does anybody have any questions? No questions. All right. No questions. Everybody's quiet. Then. They have, they just have, uh, they have 17 on Facebook and three on YouTube. Oh my goodness. It's quiet tonight. Bonnie Fuller says, looks like some of our Florida sunsets. Oh, wonderful. I get a little bit more pink. I'm having to look in my water girls and see which is which. <laughs> oh, I'm, oh, I just absolutely love that. But I don't really want to see those drips, so I'm going to wash that down here in just a minute. I'm going to have my beach grass come up further on one side. We had so much fun doing that piece a few weeks ago that I kind of wanted to replicate it but with a with a tall piece and the bronze is a perfect complement to or excuse me the copper is a perfect complement to all of this blue uh Catherine Miles Australia is in the house hi Catherine how are you Kathy Cooper is here I love this and I brought a friend a oh. friend Kathy welcome friend Missy Yoder hello hi Missy Hey, Kathy Buckley says there's 112 on Facebook. Oh, Matt was teasing me. So this is what I'm calling my color wash, you all. And I'm having, oh my goodness, I can't wait to photograph that. We're alive, baby. Don't touch my brownies. Just go. No. <laughs> okay, so this right here. Is settling in perfect. It's kind of getting in that grain, but see right here where it's too drippy? I'm not gonna do that. Oh. Gonna make sure it washes away. Right. Trish Hardy is on with Kathy. Okay, this is good. You know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and get one more squirt of yellow right here. We're working on a watered down. Terry Jackie says uh, 42 on YouTube. Oh, Matt tricked me. How much paint to water? We're in saying your one water to bottle? ten. Ten to one. Ten to, ten to water. One. Ten to one. Yeah. Ten Step away from the brownies, Matt. No, that was actually Elijah walking in here because <laughs> he came downstairs and he smelled them. How? I was so much nervous when you started with cherry picked, but as usual, it's already gorgeous. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Hi, Gail. Lamuki. How are you, sister? Okay, so let's treat it like it's a watercolor. So we've added in some of the kissing booth, but it seems to want to be washing away, and I want more of it. Shaz says, saving me from a lockdown in the UK. 
Well, welcome. I hope you can enjoy yourself tonight, Jazz. Thanks for being here. Teresa Duvall, this is stunning. I can't wait for the oh, shoot. new DIY products to get here so I can try them out. Oh, did you order some? Who is it? Uh, this is Teresa Duvall. Okay. Duvall. Guys, I now have the paint on my website, which is kind of exciting. I was being stubborn about it for the longest time, um, but now you can order just directly off my website at theturquoiseiris.com. No worries, Betty. How you doing, sister? We added Kissing Booth. Uh, we added a little bit more yellow in the center, and we came back in with a little bit more blue iris. Um, I was going to add Cherry Picked, which is the darker purple, but I can't get the water bottle to work, so there's that. Gorgeous colors. I'd love to know. Oh, it went away, Matt. I didn't get to answer. Uh, it's one record nut, uh, which is, she said her name earlier, and I apologize. I think it's Wendy, I think. Uh, gorgeous colors. I'm, I'd... Love to know how you decide what color is next. Oh, man. That's a great question. I just trust my instincts. And since I'm going kind of with a sunset, um, I'm just kind of thinking blues and the deep purples and the intents of those colors that really get us when we go, ooh, look at that sunset. Uh, that's kind of what I had, kind of what I had in mind. And so um, now for the bottom part, we, are, we do need to do beach grass, but in order to do the bottom part, um, I kind of want a background that's a little bit deeper. Um, so I'm actually going to get Bohemian Blue and spray it along the bottom. So Matthew, we need to lower and I will sit on the floor. Abby will probably be up in your business. Yeah, Abby will probably be right in our business, but that's just the way it's going to have to go. Tell me sit down. Go lay down. Oh, I'm just loving this, guys. I can't wait till we actually get the, the beach grass on here and such. Um, it looks good everywhere. No, it needs to come down just a little bit more, please. Thank you. Okay, so now I have Bohemian Blue. And since, does that make sense? I want to I wanna hand paint my design, but in order to do that, I kind of want a background. That is, let's see if we can hook that back up there so it doesn't pull on the phone and knock it off. Okay. Sorry, guys. Thank you for the thumbs up and the hearts, by the way. I appreciate you all so much. Thank you, Gail. So I kind of want a background of almost as just creating shadow. And so in order to do that, I'm going to go ahead and use Bohemian Blue before I do anything else. Double Tuttle Kane, hello from Ohio. Hi from Ohio. What I think I'll do is I'll end up brushing on a thin coat of the High Carry Carter of the um, the Cherry Pick because I had it in my water bottle and it's just not coming out of the water bottle. So um, I do though want to hit some of those areas there with some Cherry Picked. Okay, we're ready for this. Let me make sure I have my clear handy because my clear water without any paint in it because the Bohemian Blue will come on pretty hot and heavy if you're not careful. Hi, Donna. Pizza crust. I'm eating pizza and my two littles are getting. Um, Abby is obsessed with pizza crust, Karen. Obsessed. Like, while I'm eating it, she literally will drool on me. On the table. What? Okay, this is Bohemian Blue. Lorraine Parsons, hello from Cape Cod, Massachusetts. Hi, from Cape Cod. I didn't bring the bronze all the way down just because I knew I'd be covering it up with uh, beach inspired grasses and we'll just see, we'll just see. We might even put some little flowers. Derek called Carlton says, understand the background at the bottom. Good. Bonnie says, so glad she gets to watch this. I'm so glad that you're watching. Thanks for being here, Bonnie. Okay. Just getting a little bit darker at the bottom. Although, 
it seems a little more watered down than I was hoping for. I really wanted it to be darker than this, so I'm wondering if I need more Bohemian Blue in here. And guys, gravity tape does its thing, so you don't have to worry about ruining your furniture, because really, gravity's pulling that water off, and DIY paint dries so quickly. Donna um, Rob, I have just tried a background. So hard for me, lol. The paint definitely does blend if wet too much and disappear to a mess. Okay. It takes a little bit of practice when you're blending. But I always say that the paint does the work for me because it naturally blends. It's very porous and so it's very well, it overlaps. Did I use sea glass? No, not on this one. I used mermaid tail and beadboard and mix those. Those are the the turquoise, that's the turquoise that I used. Hi everybody, How, welcome Instagram. I appreciate you being here. Hey, hey, my name is Dion Woods. And I added some more Bohemian Blue to this because it really, you really can't even tell that I just sprayed it all over. Can you? Mm -hmm. The Bohemian Blue? Nope. Yeah, it's not thick enough, so I'm gonna try this out. Me too, Betty. Um, new, new products. If you missed it yesterday, I'm planning on putting the Verdigree wax on the hardware and I am going to load it up on these beautiful knobs right here. These pools, they're kind of a teardrop pearl um, drop. And then anywhere else I can maybe do the Verdigree, probably on the legs. I'm gonna put copper on the legs as well. These pretty little Queen Anne feet. Okay, let's see if this is any better. Maybe, here's what's gonna happen. It's gonna be too thick now. Maybe. Did you do 10 parts to one? Um, sure. Well, that's just what we tell everybody. I know, but I don't measure. I'm trying to give them an idea. Okay, this is better. Kathleen Nolan says hello, Dion. Can I get a little late? Hi, Kathleen. Thanks for being here. Packages went out today for aprons and purses, by the way. Purses are, there's still some purses. Oh yeah, this is way better. Purses are still be, uh, uh, still available. Got Lolly Lolly in the house. What's up, Lolly? Okay, this is way better. I don't need to add any water to it, and I may actually end up doing a second coat. It's hard to tell. So if you could imagine some grass over here and um, anything else we want to add. Uh, Christina Reagan, what color are you using? I just popped on. This is Bohemian Blue in a spray bottle. Also known as? What? Boho. Boho Blue. Mm -hmm. It's very watered down, you guys, so... I may need to just completely let it dry because gravity is really kicking in <laughs> and washing it all away. But you get the idea of what I'm trying to do, right? Um, and then we took yesterday, we took our brayer and I wrapped um, the, the press and seal around it to create this gorgeous texture from the new copper. I think it's fabulous just like that. Gail, thank you, I kind of do too, but I kind of wanted to put a beach scene on it too. Um, okay. So we really just kind of have to let that sit because I think I'm going to end up needing another layer. But let's put some more yellow in here, okay? Right here in the center. Oh, now we're talking. Look, Matt. You can't really see it on the YouTube. Oh, well, we need to go back higher. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go higher. Back up. Please. Thank you. Matt, did you memorize pennies from heaven? No. I did not. Me neither. I was planning on it, but I had coaching calls most of the day. We need to go all the way. Um, I had coaching calls most of the day and didn't have time to listen to pennies from heaven. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. 
Hi everybody, Rainbow505, what's up girl? Okay, so I've put in some more yellow. This is our, this is fun, this is fun. You wanna do it? No. Do you wanna spray some kissing booth? Nope. No? No. Nope. Why? I'm not a kissing booth kind of guy. Well, what color would you spray? Old school. You walked right into it. I know, I wanted to kind of take it back as I said it out loud, but it was too late. It was too late. Did they not have presents sealed in Australia, Catherine Miles? Oh, would she not know where to get it? I don't know. She says, I wish I could get presents sealed in Australia. Oh, that's so strange. Don't you think that's strange? Wow, Victoria Turner Howard. That is the name of my store, Pennies from Heaven Collectibles. What? How wonderful, what a beautiful name. That's the name of I didn't realize how ignorant cover. I was to Penny's from Heaven. Heaven. I know, because then we were like, what is that a song? And we were both I was like, I was being I was kidding actually. I was I was thinking of the Eric Clapton. You song were thinking of a totally different I was thing. Tears in Heaven. Tears yeah. in Heaven, Tears from Heaven, and I was not thinking about it at all. Look how beautiful this is drying. So we have copper underneath here. It's a beautiful compliment. And so, gosh, maybe we don't need beach grass. Do we? Do we need to Captain hand paint Miles, a design? She said, capital S A D, sad, with a sad face. So, so Mary Ellen Stout, is present still the same as saran wrap or sling wrap? Um, no, it's actually, I'll show you the difference. Where I'll, I'll show you what present still looks like. I wrap my brushes in it. Because it sticks to it, it sticks to itself a lot better. And um, people are just saying, just leave it as it is. Nice. Oh my goodness. Okay. See, it's a little bit like it's it's not as clear, and it's easier to handle. To me, Saran wrap, like like you know, you can. I don't know. I just like this better, and this is what I can wrap my brushes with when I'm in, on a, using a project. Uh, this is what Queen Allen told me she uses. And so I bought some of it, love it. No, no beach grass, more copper. We call it cling film, okay? Oh, here we are, we got Janet from another planet. Sup, Jan? I'm in awe, this is so pretty, I could watch this all night. If I'm wishing it was bigger, and I would do this all night. This is incredibly fun. And now I'm thinking I wanna pull, I just don't know, this is too much fun. Now, yeah, Betty says it's sort of a cross between saran wrap and wax paper. Okay, yes, exactly. Exactly. Stacy Hartman says it's not a matter of need. Sometimes it's, I just gotta do it. Yeah. 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 Diane says uh, more copper would be yummy warm. Okay, let's do it then. It's awful purpley. I know, I know, Matt, but just hang on. Getting very purpley. Purpley. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. No more purpley. It's very purpley. Okay. Starting to remind me of. Uh, oh, it's so pretty, though. Hello, Laura. How are you? Starting to remind me of that, that purple dinosaur that was on for years. The kids' cartoon? Barney? Barney. 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 Betty says, patience, Matt. Barney. Uh, Derek Carlton says, yes to beach grass. Hey, Dion, your new wardrobe looks like Barney, the big purple dinosaur. Um, Alice is on. Hi, Alice. How are you doing, Send, sister? Sending prayers to your daughter and you. Hey, Barney. Mary on, beauty's on. The gang is here. The gang is here. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Um, we're gonna get some more copper in just a minute. Tammy McLe McLeod 
or have you ever watched abandoned French looks like mansions on YouTube? The gorgeous furniture left behind is stunning. No, I haven't. It's like a channel on YouTube? I'm not sure. Now I just feel like I'm spray painting. And, you know, it dries. I mean, the top's almost dry, and you guys saw me spraying on it a few minutes ago. So it definitely does its thing. I'm spreading out the yellow, mixing colors. Katrina says he doesn't know how to push your buttons at all. <laughs> Not at all. Uh, Kathy Cooper says more copper than turquoise wax. Magical. Magical with the patina wax. However, he did make brownies tonight. How about painting the birds of paradise? Mm. Hey, hello, Miss Dion. Looks pretty, Jordan. Thank you. Just search abandoned French mansions. Tammy or will do that. Thank you. All right, let me get the copper and a brush. I have a question. Yes, sir. You know, they a lot of people chime in because yes. we ask them to. Yes. About what to do next. Yes. My question to you guys on the tubes and the Facebook. Would you, cheerleader? Would, would, with a piece like this, would you continue to work on it, taking your recommendations, or would you stop? Hope that makes sense. No, nope, I don't understand. Well, the question. You're is, asking them. Yeah. Would you leave as is, or would you would you keep going? Oh, like with the beach and like, is that what you mean? Like to do the beach grass? Just. Yeah, I mean, you know, they come in with some, some really, I mean, you know this group, they come in with some oh, great, man, there's some talent great, in. yeah, great ideas. Would they continue with those ideas, or would they stop because they're scared? Oh. Oh, I see. Are you trying to call them scaredy cats? Not at all. I'm just curious if, if Or, they, are you saying yeah. you guys make suggestions, but would you have the courage to right. do it? Right. <laughs> so I'm going to highlight some of this gorgeous trim with the copper, okay? This is the copper. This is Pennies from Heaven. It is, I think she used liquid sunshine. I did, Mary, in the in the water bottle. It's watered down liquid sunshine. It's DIY's bright yellow. You can also get that on my website. I'm going to just hit the top of this trim and bring out some more of it. Most people are saying you just do what you feel. Well, I'll be honest with you, I usually do. Yeah, a lot of them say, just, they, they said, Matt, be quiet, just let her do it. <laughs> That's not what they said. <laughs> they did not. <laughs> and Betty says, the hard part for me is sometimes knowing when to stop. Yeah. I think that's true as because well. Because you want to just keep messing with it, right, Betty? Yeah. Sometimes you've already turned it into something wonderful and you just you keep going. Either because you're unsure or it's just too much fun. But, okay, what do you think about me highlighting this trim? Can you all see it a little bit better? Put your money where your mouth is. Ooh, Heather! Challenging Miss Gale. So I'm using the cheerleader, you guys. It makes it really easy to just kind of tap your brush onto this trim. And keep in mind, if you do decide to go for it, there are projects, products like baby wipes and prod ducks like sanding sponge you could always pull off the top layer if you decide that you went too far or added in too much color okay looks amazing with the copper awesome let's keep going then so I'm pretty happy with the top part the bottom part needs some work but that's because I was planning on adding in beach grass Derek says, depends. You have to go with what you feel at the time. It's true. Very true. So true. I'm just kind of curious how other people, if, if, if you guys are kind of all the same, is it a strict plan or is it I get started with one plan and then kind of morphs into another plan? Because that's typically, I think, how yours kind of transpires for the most part. Just curious. That's all. Totally. I love it. I did the same things in Seeing Glass and Waterloo with Golden Ticket. Uh, yep, Susan, I did Sea Glass and White with the water lily and the um, 
cherry picked on my last piece that Denise Parks has right here or is getting today or tomorrow. Thank you, Betty. I think that piece is supposed to be delivered today or tomorrow, depending on travels. Shaz says, this kind of painting feeds my soul. Me too. Unfortunately, not popular in my area. Well, what's popular in your area, Shaz? What style is popular there, Shaz? Whoa, Rita Young's in the house. What's she doing? I haven't seen do? her in a while. Oh, Rita Young. Hey, girl. Okay. All right, so we're adding in more copper. Okay. Matthew, back down, please. And I definitely want to do the little feet, the Queen Anne feet. Much further. Further. Has anybody else done the uh, color wash? Have you any of you ever put color? It's thank you, Betty. Have any of you ever put color in your spray bottles? Um, like I said, this one I'm actually using Kissing Booth in this the Water Girl. It's working out perfectly, so that's good to know. <clears throat> Angela Robinson, I'm extremely risk taking with my art but i often go too far i never know when to stop uh yeah it's so hard to know i just figure it's just paint as heather watson's business is it's just paint y'all denise o'hare is getting the piece on thursday now james called yesterday oh i'm sorry for the delay denise i wondered if this whole um you know virus would kind of hold him up a little bit in areas his um of course, he has to travel and watch his hours, too, so. Something or nothing. I start with an idea in my head, but as the layers go on, the exact idea changes. Sometimes completely, but always a little. Yes, I have used all different colored washes. Okay. I remember the first color that I put in my spray bottle and sprayed it on. It was, um, it was Hey Sailor, so that's our navy. Mary says, I need to be more of a risk taker. Hi, Carrie Carter. I see those hearts. Let's show her some hearts. Thank you, Robert. Thank you, guys. You need to be more of a risk taker. Well, it is fun, and you will often find that that is where it sparks your creativity enough to where you, um, you, just, you find that there's a little bit of comfortableness in there. there, there it, you can get comfortable in being uncomfortable when you're creating your art. Uh, Matthew, I want to paint the legs. I'm not sure they can see this if I sit all the way down. I'm on was that, it. Was that a big sigh that you were tired of getting up? I'm on it. Can they see anything? Yeah, they sure can. Thanks. Are you guys sharing for me? Oh, okay. Okay, awesome. No problems. Thanks, Denise, for being patient. So I'm just using a little bit. The, the gold liquid patina goes a long ways, okay? And it usually is completely 100% dry in about 20 minutes. And I'm just gonna hit the legs here because I'm gonna use our verdigris wax, the turquoise wax, to patina it and just really give it a distressed look. But I just can't decide, I'm not gonna lie, I can't decide about the beach grass. We, we just, we took a different route on this one because it's turning out so pretty. Crystal Dunwell says, cute NC hat. Your hat, that's on your head. Wilmington, North Carolina, up in here, Beach and Barn. We wear all their hats and their shirts. I even have their turquoise stocking cap. Been wearing them for years. Something or nothing, I have yet to use DIY paint, but waiting for my first shipment of five colors. Oh, oh you're gonna be so happy. I'm so glad you're willing, you're trying it out. See you later, Laura. Bye, Laura. Who's Laura? Which Laura? Sparago. Okay. Have a great night. Uh, Lolly Lolly wants to see the beach grass, honey. You do? Lolly Lolly, I do too. Oh. Crabby Blonde 13, a lavender. Purple Hearts. Thank you. Okay. 
So, we are adding in more copper because you guys loved it so much with the blue. And so I'm just kind of highlighting a few areas. I've got to let it completely dry before I start my beach grass though. You guys know that because I don't want any of it coming off. You can see where it's come down and it's purple. That's where I added Kissing Booth, which is actually our fuchsia. It's mixing with the mermaid tail and the blue iris and the bohemian blue. We've got a little bit of yellow. We can call that our sunlight because that's supposed to be our sunset kind of falling down. Um, if you get too much, if you um, you just sand it back, wash it back with a, with a wipe or a wet, damp cloth, you can also add more if you want a deeper color, which I really wanted more of a shadow back here. It's just, it's an, I even added more color to, um, do you see my lid? What are you looking for? The lid to my um, copper. Are you sitting on it? Oh. Am I sitting on it? Well, I just dusted no. it. No. I don't want to spill it. It's like gold, even though it's copper. It's actually copper. It's copper penny. Did uh, you see the lid? Maybe no, it's on no. the table over here. I don't see you. it. Oh, yeah, it's it on is. the table. Here, yep. take that. You want me to handle it? Yes, you can handle the copper pennies. Um, so let's do a little bit of Bohemian Blue before we go because I think we have to completely let this dry and let me look at it in the morning to determine where we're going to go from here. But yeah. More bohemian blue at the bottom. And Spanish teachers. I love that his Spanish teacher's texting him information still. Okay. Rainbow 505 says, not sure about the seagrass. Not sure, huh? Not sure. I'm not either now because I love it all so much. Kelly Miller would like to know what brand of copper you're using. And so where to get it? On my website at the turquoiseiris.com, Kelly Miller. It's called Copper Liquid Patina. It's a brand new product that just came out from DIY Paint on Saturday. And we and and uh, Teaspoon has a question, Dion. Looks like I missed it, but did you use petticoat pink? Nope, I didn't. No. No, there is some French millinery underneath here on the first night. Yeah, Teaspoon was yelling at me. Teaspoon she was, like, was all yelling? Cat. So I was like, whoa, she's mad. I better read this question. <laughs> uh, Ramblin' Rome, wait, I can't leave till you tell me if you listen to Pennies from Heaven. I did. We listened to about six different versions of it. My favorite one was the one uh, Robert sent. It was a female. Who was the female singer, Robert? I don't remember. But that was my favorite one because I was able to match her tone when I was singing and I couldn't I couldn't match all those wonderful men that were singing it. And Matt was singing it. And he has a deep voice and he was rocking it. I said, will you sing that tomorrow? He said, no. Maybe a bit of grass and small clumps and sand going into the water, maybe. Tucson Summer says, no seagrass. Doris Day, thank you, Heather Watson. It was Doris Day. It was pennies from heaven. Now, now Rita's yelling at me. Rita's yelling now. One of the too. new products that came out on Saturday. Rita! Where have you been, Rita? Rita! We're, okay. Now we have to go through the whole... No, there's only there's only three, babe. Oh, I know. Can you hear one? And yeah, then, you, you see her, the wax? Gotta, oh, it's right you, there, baby. You gotta tell her where to get it. So. Copper. Pennies from heaven. So it's... The consistency is exactly like... Thank you. Exactly like the golden ticket. The exact same thing, but it's finally copper. I've been trying to mix up a copper. It was so wrong. It was so wrong. For so like mine had more red in it. This is a true copper. And then we have the verdigris wrap, uh, excuse me, wax, and it's called shipwrecked. You want wispy seagrass with white tips. That's good. It does look Caribbean-ish. Uh, okay, so this, I'm using both of these products. I've already used the copper that I rolled on. And then there's also a stain blocker for all your furniture sins is what it says. Um, so those are the new three products. They're all on my website and available to you today, right now. Uh, yesterday we got off of the live and four of you had gone and placed orders. So I was like, look at them. They're just like Johnny on the spot. So good, so good. And I appreciate you so much. Also, I put the water girls 
on our website. So Matt can box those babes up, ship them right to you, can't you, Matt? Yeah. Yes. Water girls on my website. Want it? I can do it. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, Alice, for putting that on YouTube. I appreciate it. Are there any plans for metallic silver? Kathleen, that's a great question. I don't know. You don't? I don't know. I remember there was a silver in the beginning, and then I don't think it was a big seller. So maybe they'll bring it back. Um, I think what I'm going to have to do is come back tomorrow morning when this is dropped YouTube to reconnect. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, you need to reconnect. There we go. It's good now. So what I'm thinking is even if it's just one side of just like a little bit and the breeze blowing. Maybe just a little bit. I don't know. You're going to have to know. just look at it tomorrow. It's so pretty, though. What yeah. if I mess it up? Well, you never know. What? What do you mean you'll never know? I never know. You never know. Uh, Janet from Another Planet, what's going on with the Creator Connection and the waiting list? So we're opening April 4th, uh, maybe April 3rd, if you pay really close attention. Um, it is opening up. So what do we have next Friday? Not this Friday, but a week from Friday. We'll be open, and we only open every three months. But if you're interested in getting on that, uh, be on the waiting list. I will send you a reminder and also the link to join on the 3rd. We'll probably open up around Friday Night Live. That's probably what we'll do. Um, probably walk away. Friday. Probably. Well, yeah. I don't know. Uh, sketch it out. You know I'm terrible about sketching. No I'm graphs on this sketcher. one. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't ever sketch. Yep, I'm going to see what it looks like tomorrow. You guys were awesome. Thanks for hanging out with all of our, our painting and our spraying and all of our different colors. And DIY paint, like I said, it's so porous that it automatically just does its work for you. It does the job for you. So uh, the copper, it's like going to be my best friend. Uh, uh, Dion, where can we send you pictures? What is your email? Oh, send me pictures? Teaspoon. Dion at the turquoiseiris.com. Dion is D-I-O-N-N-E. Thank you, Tucson Summer. I will trust my instincts, but I need to take some time to look at it tomorrow and stand back and look at it. So, um, hey, Kelly Weiler, thank you. Can this be done on a wall? It 100% can be done on a wall. It is actually how we did our wall in the old house. Uh, we put the paint on there and then sprayed it and just kind of let it drip and everything. You guys, thanks so much for being here. And I don't think I'm gonna be back tomorrow. I have Talk To Me Tuesday in my Creative Connection. Um, but Wednesday, you back up on Wednesday, we will be here Wednesday. So you're going to have to wait. I'm sorry. Um, but if you have any questions, email me, message me, and um, we'll be back for now. Brownies. They didn't, you don't think the boys ate them all? Oh, no, they're done. It's all over now. You may have, you may be able to lick the bowl. You might be able to lick the bowl. That's what you, have, that's what you get when you this have to has boys. to be wrong. This See ya. Has, no, this has to be wrong. Good night, you guys. This has to be wrong. The brownies, they better be in there.